welcome back in this tutorial we will create some exercises based on what we learn in previous tutorial we will be creating these two objects click on new ok then sketch click on sketch select on the plane at first we will have to create this octagon of 20 edge length Click on polygon, give number of edges to be 8. Click the center point, drag the point and click. Then done, escape. Now we need this line to be horizontal. So select this line and make it horizontal. Done. An edge length, click on smart dimension, select the edge, click below, give the edge length of 20. Enter. Then escape and next is this pentagon of page length 25. Click on polygon, then give the number of pages to be 5. Then we don't want it around center, we need a gap of 6 from this horizontal line. So we will not create it on center, we will create it a bit below, then make it vertical and click. Then escape, smart dimension, give the edge length of 25. Then select these two horizontal lines and give the gap of 6. Ok, this is created. Then next is hexagon of 26 face to face distance. Again select polygon. Give number of pages 6, click on center point, then drag horizontal and click there. Then smart dimension from this line to this line 26. Escape. Escape. So it is created. Then last will be this shape above. A rectangle 20 by 14. Just pan it. Create by line, vertical line, horizontal line, and vertical line. Then smart dimension. This is of 14. And 20 is already. We have given the 20. So no, no need to give 20 again. Escape. This drawing is ready. Next drawing is this, this, click on new, ok, sketch or the top plane, here at first we will create this reference line at first, so click on arrow, line arrow, then center line, drag the point, pan it by pressing the control, roller scroll and dragging the mouse again line track click escape one line here ok one horizontal line is also needed here then place the dimensions smart dimension from here to here It is 90. Then from here to here, it is 45. That's all. Then create the circle to of 28 and 38 diameter. Escape. Click on circle. Give the center point. Second point, center point, second point. Smart dimension, select the internal. So it is of 28 and external of 38. Then one more circle is there of 40 radius, 80 diameter. 
circle click the center point drag outside smart dimension so it will be of 80 skip then next will be these two circles that is internal circle is 20 dia 2 into dia 20 and external is 20 radius so again circle from this intersection point and one more from the center point smart dimension it is of 20 diameter 20 and outside is of 40 diameter then one more is needed here one circle at this intersection and one more and give the smart dimension internal is of 20 dia and external is of 20 radius that is 40 dia then we will have to create this circle of 26 touching these two circles 26 radius so create one circle and give the dimension smart dimension so 26 multiplied by 2 enter then escape then select this circle control select this circle and make it tangent click on tangent escape same way select this circle control select this circle tangent so it is created then next will be this 98 radius circle again create one circle then give the smart dimension so it is 98 so 98 multiplied by 2 ok then just drag it escape ok again select this circle control select this circle make it tangent escape select this circle control this circle tangent ok escape now unwanted entities have to be removed for that we will use trim click on trim entities and use power trim to remove it zoom it and remove just click the first button and drag it then here zoom fit ok then next will be a here one horizontal line is needed and here arc of radius 9 is needed so create line from this intersection point horizontal line up to this curve escape then trim power trim escape then one arc of 9 for that we will use fillet sketch fillet so put the 9 enter select first curve second curve done zoom fit then last will be the line tangent line one tangent line is there so click on line click on the curve and drag it until a tangent symbol shows once it has been shown click there escape so tangent lines are tangent line is created so in this way both the objects are created so we will stop here thanks for viewing